Hey there, uh, in this video I want to talk a little bit about why I think the iOS update that now accepts PS4 and Xbox One controllers as an input is a potential Switch killer, Nintendo Switch killer. So basically, uh, I'll, I'll tell you from my perspective, I feel like, do you really need a Switch if uh, you're not super into the Nintendo first party games like Zelda, like Splatoon? Uh, like the modern Mario platformers, whatever, Galaxy and all that stuff, whatever. I don't even know what it is because I don't really play those games um, unless I'm playing with my kid. So that's kind of why I feel like if you're more, so if you're more into like regular, I don't want to say regular games, but if you're more into the games like Fortnite, well, guess what? Fortnite added controller support to their mobile app. So now you can, and I did it yesterday, you can play Fortnite mobile. Uh, with an Xbox One controller and your iPhone. So, um, that's, yeah, I don't know. That, that kind of slipped by my radar, but I tried it yesterday, and sure enough, it worked. I didn't mention it in my last video, but um, you certainly can play Fortnite. I mean, that's a huge game. Um, you know, imagine if they added, like, a Brawl Hall. A Brawl Hall isn't anywhere near as popular as, as Fortnite. I mean, Fortnite's huge. Call of Duty just went mobile, uh, like, today or something like that. Um and you it has controller support they they pulled it out but i fully expect controller support to be in there in the next few weeks uh think about all the games you can play some of the most popular um games that are out there are, are now on mobile so why do you really need a switch um a 400 hundred dollar switch if you get the, the the main one and now they, they just put out the new one that's 200 bucks it's a nice little device don't get me wrong but like you know, with all of the iOS, uh, the good games that are like basically way more affordable. You've already got you've already got the iPhone. You've already got the Xbox One or PS4 controller. You get yourself a little Amazon mount. Um, you know uh, that connects your phone to your controller. Um, I mean, you've got yourself a like a budget switch at a fraction of the cost, uh, just using stuff you already have. So. Um, that's why I think, yeah, this, this is potentially a switch killer with the caveat, uh, you know, of course, if you're into Zelda, if you're into Splatoon, if you're into Mario platformers and Yoshi, um, this will never replace that unless, you know, you, you're willing to get by with Mario run that goofy little, um, platformer or, uh, you know, the new super Mario Kart game, that, um, super Mario Kart tour, whatever they're calling it. I haven't played it yet. Um, but I heard they're like charging, like you have to pay every month just to get access Mario or something like that. So that they're, they're making some some not so great decisions, I think. But um, you know, just for the majority of like kids these days who who only really uh, obsess about Fortnite, um, they can get by. Like if if you're only a Fortnite player, do you really need to shell out four hundred bucks or even two hundred bucks for a Switch? If Fortnite is your main game and you can play it for free on your phone with a controller, so um, that's that's a question that uh, I think people need to ask themselves. And um, I don't you know, take advantage of this. This is awesome. This is a great time in gaming. You can just plug in the controller you already have and, and play games. And and I I don't yet have one of those uh, adapters that that connects your phone to your to your um, controller. With those little mounts or whatever you call it, uh, I'm looking into them. Um, I, I guess I was like, all right, let me find a decent game. Um, but like just just for Fortnite, like my kids are playing Fortnite uh, and I'm sitting in the room just hanging out. Like, let me hop into a game or two without having to walk over to my Xbox and set it up and, you know, all that rigmarole. I could just hop on my phone and, and do it, you know. So, um, yeah, it's a, it is a great time in gaming, I think. Um and the sky's the limit so we'll see how things pan out uh that's pretty much all i had to say let me know does this make sense to you do you think this has any chance of being a switch killer um do you like those first party games let me know um you know they're good i, I do like playing the mario platformers and uh zelda is just an absolute classic but if it's not your if it's not a big deal for you i do think this could be a switch killer so um I hope everyone is having a great night, and I'll talk to you all soon.